Today, we look at the differences between fstring, ftext and fname in Unreal Engine and in which cases you should use each of those types. Today, we just look at the conceptual differences of those types. However, in the future, we will take a look at each of them individually, with ftext becoming extremely relevant when talking about UI in Unreal Engine. But first, let's get started with fstring. This is the most basic string class in Unreal Engine and also easily allows to combine strings in different ways. This type is commonly used if you want to prepare text in a certain way or log the text to the output log. Next, I want to talk about ftext. This is a specific type of variable to represent text which is presented to the user. Therefore, if your game supports different languages and you want to display the different translation for a certain text value in your UI, then you have to use ftext for this variable to make it easily work with the localization system of Unreal Engine. Lastly, we have fname. This type is usually used as a textual identifier for an object. Some attributes of fnames are that they are immutable, case insensitive and support fast lookup. Fnames are usually used to identify your objects like the display names in the world outliner for the different objects or the names of your assets in the content browser. As you can see, each of those data types has a specific purpose, with fstring being the most general option and ftext and fname being designed for more specific scenarios. Furthermore, it is very easy to convert a text value between those types. But we will talk about those things when we look at each of those types individually. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments. Otherwise, see you next time.